Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is the um, second video in the little series of videos on the Windows Security app or what was called Windows Defender. Actually it's still called Windows Defender in certain places inside the app. Um, it's of course the antivirus, anti-malware software integrated into Windows 10. So the second option we'll check out today in the uh, Windows Security is the account protection. So once again you need to have a little check mark there, it's better if you are. You've got a few security settings for the account protection. First of all is the account information. You, you see here what account you're using as a Microsoft account in Windows 10. You can view your account information. What is that? It brings you to the PC itself with all the billing and the information about how your accounts are set up, if it's a local account, Microsoft account, and so on, you get all the settings information there. You can actually manage your Microsoft account. You can sign into a local account instead if you wish, and so on. There's sync settings. When you manage sync settings, it tells you what actually syncs between machines uh, when you have several Windows 10 machines. But even if you have only one, there's another thing that um, sync does and it's if your PC needs to be clean installed with Windows 10 again well this is cool because by turning on the sync settings once you log back in to your Microsoft account it will actually uh, re-download the same theme you were using the same settings it's gonna you know know what uh, you want basically as your preferences within the Windows settings and so on which is kinda cool uh, when you actually, you know, want to reinstall a, a Windows PC. There's sign-in options that you can actually set up. So this is also for protection options. It includes Windows Hello, which is a camera-based uh, face recognition. Fingerprint, a PIN. I have a PIN, for example, on mine. I also have a password. Uh, if you have a security key, you can also have a picture of passwords. All security options to prevent unwanted people to get into your accounts and finally there's dynamic lock dynamic lock uses Bluetooth on your device so the way you set it up you um, if you have Bluetooth available on your PC you can actually link it with your phone's Bluetooth that means when you move away at that time when the Bluetooth connection is lost it will actually lock your PC so nobody will have possibility to access your PC um, at that time because it knows that you're, you kind of moved away. So this is all in the dynamic lock, so which is allow Windows to automatically lock your device when you're away. It of course works with a phone, a smartphone, and you need to have Bluetooth on both devices for this to be set up. Um, I've tried it a few times. I might need to try it again. I haven't tried it in the May 2019 update yet, but um, that, I should check it out again. I was, uh, I, it didn't really work very well the first time that I did try it when it was one of the first times the setting appeared. So all of that is in a Windows security app in account protection. Of course, all of that is linked to different settings within your PC. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up, and thank you for watching our videos.